Good day, good driver. It is good to see you again, fam. You already know it's your girl Esther Joy coming at you with another video, and on this channel, we love to talk about love, light, joy, and peace. So if you, my friend, like all of those vibrations, then you are in the right place. And we, today, are going to be spreading them Per usual fam, per usual, okay? I don't even need to tell you to hit that subscribe button to officially join the Good Vibes Delivery family because fam, it's really about time we talk about the Galactic Federation of Light, okay? I'm so excited to make this video. So without further ado, what is the Galactic Federation of Light? I'm sure we've all, if you're watching this video have heard about it in some way whether it be an outside source external or internal either way they are talking to you and I want to say that that is such a beautiful thing and it's so beautiful to be able to have their assistance and be aware of how much assistance the Intergalactic Federation of Light is giving everyone at this time. For me, I really do see a lot of, I won't call shape-shifting, but like they can shape-shift into different sensations is the best way to put it. So, um, very easily so like say you are I don't know feeling uncomfortable or you are feeling um, a certain emotion and you just see that om om omen, omen. you just see that sign okay you just see that clear sign sometimes it's birds for me I love birds I, I like to see the birds you know, cuckoo. I understand where that comes from now. Um, but with that being said, um, that is just one of the many ways that it, um, this loving infinite source reveals itself to us. A lot of the times, um, you know, the Intergalactic Federation of Light is associated with aliens and like, come on guys, we're all aliens. Like, that gig is up. So with that being said, it's just really interesting to see that, you know, the ripples of the universe do come from somewhere and everything is in divine alignment. Um, and even though we as humans tend to see the duality of it all in situations, um, we also have that third aspect of self, which is so beautiful. And that is what they're here to just remind us of, um, for they know. And truly, it's such a blessing to have them helping us during this time, as you know, Earth is going through a lot. Um, like, like a battle a lot. So there's, there's, I would say, um, yeah, a battle is the best way to put it as she splits into more defined realities. Um, yeah, so it's definitely very interesting to just see this transition and to kind of just have appreciation for where we are right now in history. It's amazing. Um, so yeah, Galactic Federation of Light. They are, you know, if, if you're familiar with like the Palladians or Octorians or any of the um, universal ways that we humans have distinctified these beings there are so many more just around us really everything if we think about it is is documented and I think that's a very beautiful thing as humans that 
This is a blessing and a curse. Anyways. <sighs> okay. I'm very excited to be making more contact with the Galactic Federation of Light as they are sending down a lot of communications. And with that being said, I have to remember that at this time, a lot of people are also being communicated with the Galactic Federation of Light. And sometimes it's almost like rejecting your own love. Honestly, because they're so loving and they are so, like, they just want you, if you want to just be happy and just be now in the present moment and appreciate they just want to give you that and sometimes it's almost like you don't want to listen to them but seeing as they're shapeshifters and they're the ones that are creating up your reality um it's a part of you know really seeing that relationship again this is my relationship with the galactic federation of light everyone's will be different and it's in acknowledging that we can grow so with that being said i just want to say like <sighs> the best ways i have found to increase more contact with the galactic federation of light and um i would say i'll list three because Three is a solid number. I love three. Okay, so, all right, we got sun gazing. Sun gazing, I know everyone's like, don't stare at the sun. And if you believe in that and you think it's going to destroy your eyes, then don't do it, obviously, because you have that belief. So that is going to be your reality. So with that being said, I would say the best times to sun gaze are sunset um so beautiful and it's very soft on your eyes very soft red so whenever the the sun is more red red is a lower vibration and it's easier on your eyes so that's my advice for you when it comes to sun gazing obviously if the sun looks more blue although it's a yellow star um you know cooler then maybe don't stare at it um with that being said that has really helped me just really like just focus on something that's so bright and it's helped kind of i guess made my neural patterns they there's like a pattern there with the sun and i really like can i say that my pineal gland is like a sun and actually creating a tether to the sun from your pineal gland and like that exercise in itself is very um, powerful in my opinion. So that is one way I have found <sighs> that really helps. And I think we can actually do that exercise. The other two ways are meditation and nature. So with that being said, Said, let's just take a big breath in and just <sighs> exhale all that still air <sighs> and as we inhale Allow yourself to just hold that inhale, feel your air rising, oxygen spreading to your body. And as you inhale, allow your body to relax even more. Exhale as much as you can. And as we inhale, Take a big inhale, hold it for just a moment and really feel that oxygen distributing in your body. 
<laughs> and exhale. Fully. Allow your breath to return back to normal. Usuru kuru suru siena na na kariya siena tataru stu tokuru siu ma pariya siena tatariya siena. Kuru stu suru suwa siena tata kariya siena tataru stu tariya siena nataru shiu. So, the Federation is wishing everyone a very magical and purposeful day today, and I'm just so thankful to be able to Be able to translate some of this and Kurushu Paniana, the Lutulishun, the Paria Shakarias, and the Tokurushun. Yes, the Tokur, the Asiata Tokurus, your Toto, but so should do to the Yan. I do to Kayan, a Paparia to Kariasia, the Turushu Parian. Um, for someone watching this, they're saying congratulations, a child you will have is going to have, it's going to be from the Galactic Federation of Light. So, they were wishing you many blessings and much joy, and this can be from, I'm hearing many people, multiple people watching. So, Okay, so, um, yeah, this is, I'm so blessed to Kriyasya Tatariyasya Toto Kriyasya Mabariyasya Natariyasya Toto Kriyasya Tatariyasya Mabariyasya Toto Shuto Kriyasya Mabariyasya Toto Shuto Toto Shuto Kriyasya Toto Toto Kriyasya Mabariyasya so the Galactic Federation of Light is saying that I'm so blessed to be able to share to you guys more messages from them in future videos and they are prompting me to talk about my chakra work and my online book and saying if anyone is interested definitely check the links below and sign up to just get emails about the oncoming chakra ebook um just to stay updated i won't be bombarding you with emails i just want to be able to provide you with the best services i have and connect with you on a deeper level um so with that being said the galactic um is really excited for just the future of um the planet 5d earth is here and like communication is all around and it's so beautiful to be here now so um the galactic federation of light is also saying that someone's mother who may have passed away um, that they are telling them that they they are fine and well, thank you. Um, again, this is just messages that are coming for someone. So with that being said, I just wanted to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I really did enjoy watching it. If you like this if you found any value in this if it resonated with you then press that thumbs up right now so i know so um i apologize i know it's like a little bit on the lengthy side so really do appreciate it if you watched up to this point of course like if you have any comments if you want to connect with me more check out the links below 
um, put in the comments, you know, any comments, questions, concerns. And of course, I will get back to you. I love connecting with you that way. Um, what are you doing if you haven't subscribed at this point? Like, bro, it's right down below with that post bell notification. I post daily. You already know what I'm saying. And of course, I will see you in the next video. Have an amazing day. Good vibe. Bye.